So my colleague Phil and I are at 101 today doing a filmmaking workshop. We've actually done one previously, um, which involved largely doing an introduction to the kind of equipment that you might use when creating any kind of video, like an interview or a case study, something for use in social media. Uh, today we're looking more at the post-production side, so we're doing a little bit of filming, um, and then we're going to use the footage that's been filmed and we're going to try and create some videos in the last couple of hours of the workshop to show the editing techniques that can be used. So the building has enormous potential for shooting and you've got a, a great array of really talented uh, different types of artists coming through the building. Uh, there's no need to overcomplicate it because actually the subjects you've got to film and the place that you've got to film in is fantastic. So as long as you keep it fairly simple, you'll have really good content that's interesting to your audience. Um, although we'll look at some gimmicks and some editing tricks and things, and although you've got things like a 360 camera and a GoPro, actually, because you've got such interesting subject matter here, just going and filming what's going on day to day will create really interesting content. The simple fact of the matter is video is probably the most powerful marketing tool um, in, uh, digital, in the digital space today. Uh, so when you've got on your doorstep as part of your day-to-day -day existence here at 101. You've got so much brilliant content that you could share with a wider audience. Um, you can use that in social channels, you can use that uh, on the website, you can use that to drive SEO, and you can bring attention to the brilliant work that's done here and probably help in fundraising, um, getting audiences to events, that kind of thing, just raising awareness.